Chinese car maker Ulin is providing commuter service for delegations to the 42nd ASEAN Summit on May the 9th to the 11th in the town of Labuan Bajo in eastern Indonesia. The fleet has a total of 50 Ulin Air electric vehicles. We are honored to be part of the summit. It's proof our commitment to uh, accelerate in the green mobility in the global market. So actually the ASEAN Summit teams is actually epicentrum of the uh, growth, right? I think, I think that one, uh, so for example, Indonesia actually uh, keen to accelerate its commitment for a green mobility in the market, including in the ASEAN. I think by the government policies that has been, that has been just released, it shows uh, the commitment from the government to, to make the ASEAN also the epicentrum of growth for electric vehicle as well. Uling Motors Indonesia operates as a subsidiary of the major Chinese automobile manufacturer Saig GM Uling. It operates one production factory in West Java province and has over 150 local dealers across Indonesia. In 2022, the Uling Air EV model ranked top in the sales of the new energy vehicle segment in Indonesia, accounting for over 78% of its total. The Chinese government concept of a green environment is, is quite good. And then this is something that probably the Indonesian can learn from, from, from the Chinese government, how to implement a green environment. Because the way you do it in the last 10 years is very, very quick. I think uh, that's a good concept for us. Uh, our uh, contribution is from Wooling is basically we continue to evolve our product uh, and looking at uh, a more greener product in the future.